What's up guys? We are on the second ferry here. Let me tell you really quick why we are on the second ferry and what happened on the first one. And this is the first query, it is for free to search for anything here. The problem is that either you find something that you can take with you or you have to leave it here because those are solid rocks and there's no way to cut through them by just having a hammer. So we were looking for some things for about one hour and we found something but nothing really special. Uh, let me show you what we found here. So like I said, we didn't find anything really cool, uh, mostly just the counterparts of the fossils. And what you can see here is the counterpart of an ammonite. Uh, here is the same thing. What we found here is like, I don't know what is. it is exactly, it looks like an ammonite too. I'm not really sure. This here. Um, is a part of an ammonite. This is really cool because it's uh, so small that you can take it with you. And the last thing that, that we found are like those small diamond ores. Like this one or here, something like that. But I don't know how cool they actually are or how special they are. So we are done with this quarry here. We are going to another quarry and there will be rocks that are divided into several layers. So I think we'll find uh, some more things, but not that three dimensional. So they will be just in the layers. Um, hopefully we find something cool. Let's head to there. So on this quarry, like I said, there are a lot of layers on the rocks. You can see here, down there, there are a lot of layers and you try to separate them to find some fossils. Okay, so we already found something, if you can zoom in a bit here. A uh, local expert told me that this is a primordial crab, something like that. And we are trying to separate it by cutting the line here and over there. And then getting this layer out this way. Okay, so we man almost managed to get it out. I think it's already loose. So here, right there, you can see. I don't know if you can see, but and it's a little crab.
So we are back in my garden. I'm going to show you everything that we found right now because in the quarries it was very loud and very crowded. So here is everything that we found today. Okay, so let's have a closer look at everything that we found today. Let's start with everything from the first quarry. Like I already told you, those are just the imprints of ammonites. Here is one ammonite in 3D. Here another. Those are like diamond veins or something like that. I'm not sure how cool they really are. And let's get to everything that we found in the second quarry. So here you can see all the layers. Those are three layers, I guess. And when you separate them, you can find something like this here. This is an eminent, an eminent fossil. We found one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of them. This is the best one that we found. Here is the imprint. Here is one that is staying out. And those are like smaller ones different kind of eminent fossils. So let's get to the second ones. Those are feces. So here is one from a squid. I don't know from what this is, but those are feces too. At least a local expert told me. Okay, so the third category are called feather fish. They are like prehistorical starfish. I don't know if you can see them that good. We found a lot of them, uh, but most of them weren't that pretty. And the last two findings are my favorite ones. I found this one. I already showed you how I dug this out. This is a small crab. I don't think you can see it. I can't see it either, but the local expert told me that it is a crab. And the last one, I think it is pretty cool. Maybe you can see it. I'm not 100% sure. It is a fish, an ancient fish. So that's the coolest thing that I found. I really enjoyed doing this. I did this when I was younger, like in elementary school or something like that. We did this five to 10 times and I wanted to repeat this. So I went with my family, my girlfriend, my mom, my dad, and we found really cool things, especially the ammonites. I think they are really cool and the fish. That's a really rare finding. I really enjoyed doing this. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. If you wanna do something like this, just search for local fossil areas where you can find some of those. It doesn't matter if they are just stones and you are searching for them or if it's like really layers where you can uh, separate the layers and search for some fossils. It's really fun. I really recommend doing this. I hope you enjoyed it. See ya.